Here we have the planters. This is representing the Hawaiian history that we need to keep alive right here. Nowhere else in Polynesian was the cultivating of plants brought to a higher state of refinement than in Hawaii. At least 85 named varieties of taro and 24 sweet potatoes were developed by Hawaiian planters for, um, and they were also brought by the canoes. Archaea Agriculture was based upon knowledge of plants, soils, irrigation, seasonal cycles, and weather. And this is a really neat painting here. And the whaling ship Sunbeam is off Kanap Kanapali, Maui. By 1850, hundreds of whaling ships anchored each year in the sheltered waters of Honolulu. Lanai and Maui and Kona, Hawaiian Islands. Ports of buying provisions, making repairers, recruiting Hawaiian sailors, sailors and giving shore leave to see where he crews. Then and now, humpback whales frequented these waters, but were difficult to catch. Whalers were more interested in larger species that produce more oil. But the but there is record Hawaiian fishermen taking humpback whales near Lahaina. Boys eager, eager to impress their colleagues, whaling ship captains would often sail to Lahaina roads under all plain sail powered by trade winds until they got into the lee of the island. 